They're putting on the finishing touches inside the massive, historic Old Cook County Hospital, once home to 4,500 hospital beds, at one time one of the largest hospitals in the world. The building is approximately 550 feet long and only 80 feet wide, so it's like a, it's like a 50-story building on its side. John Murphy heads the redevelopment. Now the hospital has been renovated into two Hyatt hotels, medical office space, and first floor retail for the Illinois Medical District on the west side. Approximately 55,000 people a day visit here, and uh, it's one of the most robust medical districts in the world. The first floor to house the hotel lobby, a daycare, and an eight station food hall. It's really an amenity for the community. The building was shuttered in 2002, vacant for nearly 20 years, and over the past three years has been transformed. Hallways going from this to this. Medical training space, now hotel rooms. And talk about a stark difference from past to present. Still here, two medical theaters where the greatest minds would come to learn. Still here in the building, eventually to be restored and added as part of a tour on the history. But the most drastic change, the north facade, going from this in 2002 to a historically accurate restoration to its former glory. White ionic columns gleaming. And I think that they've done a, a phenomenal job and it's ready for its next 100 years. They hope to have the grand opening on July 1st. We're not sure, you know, what the world is going to look like at that point because it's evolving and changing daily. Uh, but we're going to put our best foot forward. Artisans had to replace more than 4,400 pieces of terracotta on that front facade there. The total cost for this phase, $140 million. Still seven more phases to go to revitalize that Illinois medical district. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.